And here we are again with Chapter 7 of Ninja Gaiden Sigma 2. Uh-oh. Oh, the rocks are falling! They're falling! What do we do? Oh no, it's cool, we're good. We're gonna go up here. And we're gonna switch back to the dual swords. And the bow. Now normally in this little uh crack in the wall there, there is a crystal skull, so if you haven't got all those, you want you'd get one there. And there should be a treasure chest with a lot of money in it here. Ah yes. Now I had 120,000 at the beginning of chapter 6. And here's another blue Muramasa shop. So we are gonna upgrade Enma's Fang. That's one mean looking face. And I guess we'll restock. See, so look at that. Now we have like 240,000. Stupid fish! We gotta run along the wall here because the floor collapses. It's already collapsed in the 360 version, but uh, that collapses in this one to show you that if you fall down, you could get back up right there. And another one. And that's three. I didn't even need any of that. More fish. <laughs> Gotta be real careful on these platforms that you don't fall off. And some more money. And that collapses there again because it's showing you that you can get up if you fall down. Stupid uh, little bone skeleton creature things. Ooh. Ah! Ugh. Now there should be a jewel of the demon seal there, and in fact, I think I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna use that right now. And upgrade the art of the piercing void up to level three. Oh yeah. Two best Nimpo in the game. Art of the Piercing Void and the Wind Blades. And now to fight tons of those stupid Skeleton things. Ugh. It does look cool when he charges that up, doesn't it? Ugh. Ugh. 
Ah, still a lot more of them. Ah. Come on. Ah. And that's that. He looks weird there, doesn't he? He looks like a bird! The 360 version just looks so much better. Uh-oh. Whoa! Giant skeleton man thing! All right, we're going to switch to the Lunar Staff for this. Ooh, I gotta be careful that you don't get hit by that. It's a one shot. The idea is that when you knock him down, your uh, staff does a lot more damage. Ah, shit. Might as well use two of those. Oh, come on! Oh, what?! I'm not doing very well, am I? And that's the end of you. Although that could have gone better. I think they only put that skeleton thing in this game because of the skeleton dragon that you fight in the first Ninja Gaiden. Jump over that. Hey, look, the Kurosai Gamma. One might think they put it there so that you'd use it on these things, but... I'm just going to use a staff. Oh yeah. One of them always survives. Always one. <laughs> Wanna save it? And on we go. Now in the 360 version of this game, there was not a bridge there. And you would fight tons more of those little skeleton things in the tunnels here, but they just decided to take it all out. I don't really mind, because, you know, it is tedious, but, you know, still. And we're outside again, thank goodness for that. Back to the dual swords it is. Should be a herb of spiritual life in there. Yep, there you go. 
Just a quick uh, change they made there. The in the 360 version, that is not the place that initiates the cutscene here. You go up the stairs, you get the treasure chests, and then when you try to come down, the cutscene is initiated. Excellent. He shall be given a most fitting welcome. <laughs> He is good at laughing, that guy. I'll give him that. We're not gonna bother going up the stairs. We're just gonna go straight in there. All that's upstairs is a Muramasa shop and a treasure chest with a not very large amount of money in it. Come on! There you go! I hate these things. These things were not in the 360 version at all. They are like lava versions of those beasts from the first Ninja Gaiden, which did not appear in this game at all. Them being added into Sigma 2, they're just a pain in the ass. Ah! Oh, I fucking hate that move. Now we have the high ground! Bitch! Stupid flying pterodactyl things and the annoying lava creatures. Ugh. Ah, that's why I hate those things. No more? Okay. Now in the 360 version of the game, those little circular places there did have, uh, one of them had a, another test of valor on it. That, uh, you know, they're taking it out of this. So up the stairs, if I don't think there's a treasure chest over here, is there? No. Alright, up the stairs we go. Now if I was to go left, there is a treasure chest full of Nimpo over there, but... I don't, there are no enemies around this corner in uh, the PS3 version, so I don't need to go use it and then go around the corner and get some, so we can go straight forward, and I'll get the chest on the way down. You son of a bitch. Down you go! Come on! Come on, won't you die, you bastard? Alright, and that's all I got time for for part one of chapter seven. Stay tuned for part two.